60 killings in at least 14 states now linked to a serial killer. Samuel Little says some victims were killed in Georgia. He's now 79 with his health failing and appeals exhausted. He's helping lead investigators to victims. He claims there's more than 90. 12 and a half years. That's how long a Minneapolis cop has been in prison for killing a woman who called 911. Justine Damon was reporting a possible assault behind her home. When police arrived, she went up to the squad car, startling Officer Mohammed Noor, who shot her. They wanted her canceled? Well, now she is. Linda Fairstein's publisher dropping her amid renewed outrage over the Central Park Five. Fairstein ran the DA sex crimes unit when the five teens were accused of beating and raping a jogger in 1989 in New York City. They were wrongfully convicted and later vindicated when a serial rapist confessed. The case coming under scrutiny again in Netflix's series, When They See Us. It may be Pride Month, but there will be no rainbow flags flying on the U.S. Embassy flagpoles. The Trump administration rejecting requests, according to the American diplomats. Diplomats say they were told they can still display the flag on embassy grounds, but the flagpole itself is a no-go.